Hello again everyone, this is Professor Muldrow. Now that you've seen how to install Python, you're going to see how to install the PyCharm development tool. You must first come to the website you're looking at right now. This website is jetbrains.com slash PyCharm. That is jetbrains, as you see right here, all one word, jetbrains.com slash PyCharm, just like you see it right here. Once you're on this site, click the download button. As you can see, PyCharm comes in two versions, professional and community. The professional version has a lot of neat features, but eventually you have to pay for a subscription. The community version is totally free open source. For our purposes, the community version is all we need. So please download the community version of PyCharm. Also, as you'll notice, by default, this is the version for Windows, but there is also a version for Mac and a version for Linux. I won't go through the, uh, all the details of the install because I've already done it on my computer. So once you install PyCharm, you get an icon like this one on your desktop with the letters PC for PyCharm and a green and yellow background. And when you click that icon, you eventually see a window like this. Now once you see this window, you must first create a project in PyCharm. So you come to New Project and you click it. And right here you're asked to give the project a name. I will just call it Hello. The Python interpreter version is given right here. Uh, you do not need to check this box to create a welcome script. You do not need this. So just click the Create button. This might take a minute. Then again, it might not. Looks like this one did it really quick. Now the thing is, though, notice I got my, uh, my project folder displayed, but there's nothing else here. You now need to create a Python file. And the way you do that is, with your project folder highlighted, as you see mine is right here, you right-click on it, you right-click on the project folder, in the menu that appears, go to New, and in the other menu that appears, you select Python File. So that, so once again, you right-click on the project folder, you go to New, and then you go to Python File. And you must give the Python file a name. I would give it the same name as the project. My project here is named hello, so call it hello as well, the file, and hit enter. And now you have this display. As you can see, I've got a line number right there. That tells me that we are ready to type code. So I will do a very simple print, and then in the parentheses, I will just do hello world, like that. All right, now then, it's time to run your program. So what you do is you come up to Run here in the menu bar and you click uh, Run with the play button next to it. And eventually this window shows up at the bottom of your screen and right here you see Hello World has been displayed. So that is how you run a program in PyCharm. If you have any questions, please send me an email at kmuldrow at lbcc.edu.